we have to go through. Chris, you have to tell tell of your exploits now when you go and see United. Uh, okay. yeah, no, no. I've done that like a million uh, times. No, right, okay, so it's, it's basically 7.42. We're on our way to Leicester. We're just going through, um, that's, we're just leaving this independent, sorry, and we're not leaving this independent <laughs> country. There's uh, England. Home again. Uh, back, back in England. And so we have with us Chris, and we have with us Adrian, and um, anyway, we will see you as we get closer to Leicester in about four hours' time. I hope you know where you're going, because that's not Adrian, do you want to just say that again in the, in the camera here? Last time last time you were at Fulton Street, though we're not going to be at Fulton Street today, but go on. Last time you were there... Well, when it was at Fulton Street, yeah. and it must have been 50 years ago, at Man Manchester United, it was the Busby Babes, and we beat Leicester 3-0, and Billy Whelan scored a hat-trick. Right, OK. Fantastic. So, I bet, no, I bet no, not many people today will be at the game today can say that they were at that game. I think you will be the only one. Although we're not at Filbert Street today, but uh, you'll be the only one. It was Filbert Street, and it, was, it must have been... It was 56, 57, I think it was... Anyway, it was definitely the, the, the babes that I saw, and as I say, we won 3-0 that day. Right. Look in the record books, you'll see. Well, we'll yeah, right. we'll definitely check that later on. You can check it. Hold on. Anyway. Right, ready? All for joke time. If Danny Blind has a really good match, do we say that he's played a blinder? I do. <laughs> <laughs> you, can you remember, and I can't remember, when was the last time that United shipped four goals after being up? 3-1. No, I can't remember. I can't remember. When, when was, I'm sure we'll find out later on the, the last time that we were ahead and then we shipped four goals to lose. I can't remember that happening. Not, not in my life. Well, well, it's not up in your lifetime. It ain't happening in my lifetime. I mean, I, I've been watching United for a long time, as you know, and I mean, I just can't remember something like that. Right. Well, to lose four goals like that. Four goals. But this, this was always my fear that we'd invest so much in, you know, to, you know, forward play that, that we're making it top heavy. Yeah. And again, that the back is still poor. I'm sure he reverted. I'm sure he started off four at the back, but I'm sure he went back, back to three at the back. Oh my God! Um, went to Luke Shaw coming on. I know. Again, So, a quick, quick thought on Wayne Rooney. No impact at all. No. What did I, what, what, obviously, the, you know, a lot of the goals were scored the other, heart, the other side of the, the game, the other side of the pitch. Yeah. But I, I can't remember, and I was watching, looking out for him to what he was doing at all, especially yeah. the second half, very, when, we, very, when we needed it, when we needed to place a bloody step up instead very, of stepping yeah. backwards. Rooney to me is very, very poor. It's, it's been. He's off, gone off it altogether. Yes, it's been poor all season. Absolutely. Oh well, we'll get Chris's thoughts when he comes back. The last time that we shipped four goals to lose a game, he can't remember in his lifetime, I can't remember it in mine, can you remember it in yours? Four goals to lose a game? Yes. We were 3-1 up. Yeah. Can't remember it. So anyway, what do you think? I mean, 3-1 up. Playing some fantastic football and absolutely cruising. We get one very bad decision against us. Yeah, yeah one. Well, only one. We should yeah, have had a free but, kick. Yeah, but still. And after that, but we just still. Fell we just fell apart. I don't know what it was. So I can't explain. I just don't get it. I mean, the referee had an absolute stinker. No doubt about it. Some, some of the decisions were shocking. Blackett was appalling. Yeah, he was. I know he's only young. You don't want to blame him too much, but. What about Rooney? Uh, well, I mean, I, I don't understand taking foul cow off. I thought he looked dangerous. Van So, so do you think we should have uh, maybe bought some key defenders? What do you reckon? Is it? Can't get it all. Try now. That's an idea. Oh my God! It's Leicester. 
Oh, no. It's wow. only Leicester! What, what, what I keep thinking to myself is that if, if, if Leicester can score five against us, what the hell is he going to do to us? It's only Leicester! What the hell? Christ almighty! Oh, this is why I hate Facebook sometimes, because I was giving it flipping large last night with the oh, Liverpool oh, score. Oh. And when I get back up the road and chip my, you know, chick, yeah, I am going to absolute really pelters. It's not really free. Oh, it's not been a good day out at all. Yeah, yes, it hasn't been a good day out at all. <laughs> Right, anyway, bye-bye. Well, yes, <laughs> that was uh, some day out. That's me just back in Scotland, it's 10 to 8, and I've driven 500 miles to see uh, that performance. Um, I don't want to go on as much as I'd like to go on to, because um, I'm knackered, to be honest with you. But anyway, um, just, a, a, just a few thoughts, post thoughts, on the match. Hmm, right, okay, quickly, uh, I'll go through a few of the people. Uh, Wayne Rooney, right, Wayne Rooney, he, he was poor, he's been poor for England. Uh, it, he didn't have a particularly, uh, probably second half of the season, last season of United. The beginning of this season for United, in fact, every game I watched uh, Rooney play for, even with England United, uh, I'm just not, I don't know, I don't, I don't know what's going on. And the, the problem is, Van Hal's now made him the captain. So if he goes to a bad form, which he, apparently to me he's doing, um, how can you drop the captain? Or again, if he's not performing too well in the game, how can you, um, how can you pull him off? If you know what I mean. So anyway, there's that one. Uh, Van Persie again. I know. I know. Obviously, he did score today. Um, even and. Yeah, he scored today, but apart from that, he, he should have scored another, I remember. Uh, then he was offside, and then he was ineffective. Yanezai, again, what's happened to Yanezai? I, I, I don't know. Is it, he sort of burst onto the scene probably a year ago when we were at uh, Sunderland away. And uh, what's happened in 12 months? Um, what, what's he done of anything, of anything, uh, of anything, of any note? in recent times. I can't think of anything. Rojo, he could be the new Evra, maybe good at going forward but no good at defending at the back. Blackett, he is only young and that guy has promised so I've st I still will, will persevere with Blackett. Problem is, yet again, is that the United uh, team are top heavy and like I said funny off the last video at the end of uh, when we beat QPR, I was saying in, in that video, it's only QPR and so it's, it's, it's you know, it's sort of panned out that way that still Still, our big Achilles heel, which is the, the same problem we've had over the, pro um, the season before, the season before, and the season before, is that we are just poor in defence. I think we've leaked 12 goals in, what, what is it, five games or something? It's something, it's something ridiculous. We've scored nine, we've leaked 12. So we're just too hoppy, we're, uh, um, too top heavy. We're, we're obviously an attacking team at the moment, you know, sco scoring some goals, obviously, but we're letting in the back like nobody's business. Um, I couldn't, I couldn't, I was a bit confused when the game sort of it looked like four in the back but it sort of, sort of went to like three in the back it was, it was, a, it was a bit odd at times um Chrissy Smalling yet again no there's there's no way in it well like I said last year he's not a right back he's pretty right back he's I, he's not a centre back either I, I don't know what Chrissy Smalling is again um some really really odd substitutions I thought uh I hope I'm hoping for God to, to, to um that uh Falcao doesn't end up being um um, the the new Forlan, oh please God, don't let that happen, but you never know. Um, what else is going to say? Oh, think the thing. Uh, Di Maria, fantastic. Shame he's not like, where he can't last the full 90 minutes. I don't get that one. And I think he was, uh, I've, I've not seen any of the footage yet, so I, I, I can't go back and see who is particularly to, to blame for it for the, the United goals. I can see the penalties, I, I saw those, they were cleat. Yeah, because the, the first penalty, I think it was a foul for us outside the back, but the young Brazilian, well, he's not even that young anymore, but what, he's, he's, he's been, again, he's been reckless. He caused a penalty when we should have had a free kick, and uh, Blackett, that was from, again, looked like a clear pen to me, but unfortunately I was the, the the other end of all the action. Only two goals happened in our goal, and uh, six happened the other, the other end, so I missed out on the action. And the fourth one, the fourth goal, which was, they seemed to score in about f four seconds of breaking from their own half. I was just watching, I'm sure it was Di Maria, 
were trying to track back the guy. I, I, I couldn't see who it was from the, from the distance. He was trying to track this guy back, and clearly uh, Di Marie is not. Um, He's not a defender like, and he won't make tackles. You know, he's good on the ball, putting crosses and scoring goals, but you can't rely on it. But unfortunately, he was tracking the guy back, and then the ball went in. And then shortly after that, of course, he he got he got brought off. So maybe he's, he's not adjusting to the pace in the Premiership at the moment. So I don't really know. But um, you know, I hate to bring up this point yet again, but uh, I do say this: is, imagine if um, David Moyes had spent that amount of money <laughs> bringing in the Galacticos in, spend vast sums of money on these players and had got performances and results like that what would we be saying right now for David Moyes so there you go yeah you know uh, I said this before and I said it again it's uh, you know how much longer do 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 uh, do we give uh, the, the Dutch man you know to, to work around his philosophy when potentially it might not work but anyway I'll, obviously we've got to give the guy time we can't get rid of him again uh, and uh, obviously we, we need to start the defence of course everyone's going about Hummels coming to United in January it won't happen obviously because Hummels is the captain of his own club I believe and of course they're still in the Champions League and of course we're not so why would he come over uh, so you know he's not going to come in January I don't see the, the defence getting showed up at all in, in January I hope Luke Shaw gets to play in, in uh, as well at left back see what he's a Left back, I hope he comes in soon. We need him, and of course, uh, Evans is injured now. Uh, Blackett, of course, is going to be suspended. So, uh, you know, we're, again, we're struggling in defence. We were struggling with the fit plays in defence. Now we're really going to struggle. So, heaven knows what's going to happen uh, the game this Saturday. Uh, yeah, we, we need to get some proper defenders. He's just gone all for attack and attacking. And in my philosophy of a team is you start from the back. You really do. Decent goalkeeper and you build it all that way. And he's like, like started from the front going backwards. It's not going to work that way. That's just my opinion, but uh, we'll wait and see. So, anyway, that's my thoughts on it. And uh, I'm going to go home now. I'm not going to watch match of the day. <laughs> but I, I did manage to um, uh, record, I think, captured most of the goals, including two of their pens on. So I'll put it on Vimeo, uh, where there should be a link to this anyway, and then you can put it on Vimeo. And anyway, that's it. Have a great rest of the week, everybody. Oh, that was that was a badging. That was a badging. Can I have my money back? No, never mind. Next, bye.